if I'm a dentist who is working chair side, which means I have a chair side milling unit, then for me it's important to have it done very simple, very straightforward and in a minimum time period. So now when I compare this block to the common ceramic or zirconia blocks, then I can do three to four crowns in the same time where I normally could only do one crown with a classical ceramic block. Because that one I have to burn, I have to glaze it, you know, sinter it, and that takes time. Ceramir, cat cam block, you mill it and it's done. You just polish it with a goat hair brush. You don't need additional polishes like silicon cups or anything like that. It's just finished. The technology, first of all, it allows us to fabricate the restorative material which mimics the natural tooth in regards of the mechanical behavior. Not harder, not softer, you know, not uh, stiffer. We really mimic what is found in nature. And on top of that, of course, the strength which we need to succeed in the clinical environment, but always on a biomimetic approach. So with the two together, it's a monoblock. And uh, of course, this is what we have in mind from the very beginning. This is what we wanted to achieve. But now we had to invent the manufacturing process to treat the material to get it where we had it in our heads already, to overcome the shortfalls which we have experienced so for many, many decades with zirconia, with ceramic and also with composite, so to speak. As I said, they all have features and benefits, but if you just grab the best out of all those worlds, then you end up with the Ceramir Bioceramic Head Cam Block. We are always looking for being very minimally invasive, so we want to keep to structure. You know, the times where everything was cut down to a crown is is over. We want to keep the natural tooth and uh, add something to the tooth which is behaving like the tooth. So with the restorative material now we correct function and we add aesthetics.